we get started, make sure your iPhone, iPad, iPod Touch are connected to your computer. Once you have all that done, we're going to open up iTunes and start this tutorial. So if, like me, you were adding music to your device and you were wondering what one of these little settings does, and next thing you know, your um, previous and next song buttons are mysteriously gone. So today we're going to be talking about what that is and how to fix it. So if we click on our song and we... Um, Actually, no, look, mine are all, we'll do this. So if we click that and then get info on all the songs, we can see on the options part here, we, like me, you probably made the mistake of remember playback position and clicking that. Now, like me, you probably thought that this was just a harmless, you know, the song pauses, you go to the next song. Maybe you want to go back to the song, you hit the wrong button, whatever. You can actually go back and continue listening to your song from where it left off. Of course, we know the people at iTunes couldn't make it that simple. So what it actually does is allows the um, allows you to rewind or fast forward your song in 30 second intervals instead of skipping to the next song or going to the previous song. Yeah, I know. I'm with you. I don't know why they did that, but for whatever reason, here we are. So to fix the error, all you have to do is simply unclick that button. Make sure it is white so this doesn't happen again. Click OK. And it's going to update. And depending on how many songs you did this for, it could take a few minutes or it could be real quick if it's just one song. And when it's done, you will note that the all your uh, previous and next buttons will return on your music in your music app so i hope this solved your problem and if it did don't forget to drop a like if you're new around here smash that subscribe button and i will see you guys on the next one